I like to search through bins looking for things to rub on my chin. This bin smells like the inside of a worm. Right you little shit, I've told you before, you must pay me three camels and rub my nipples with a pitchfork before I let you rummage in that poop bin. What a stroke of luck, she has fallen asleep on a job, she is in a coma from too much cock, I must make my escape and head to Skin Fest, there is a big party there in June 2012, this looks like a comfortable spot to rest, my boots have chafed my nuts and they are red raw, if I don't rest them now, they will pop into shredded cock snot. That night, Mr. Merlybreasts had the strangest dream, he slept like a baby. He pissed himself four times sometimes crying as he lay, he dreamt of the journey ahead and farted. I think I may have overdone the mushrooms I ate from a tramp's foot, it was a damp morning and I was so hungry I chewed off some of his toes. He said his name was Brian and he was. Do you want a fisting young man? This one's a bit special, more sexy than most of the staff here. Normally they clear tables or hover around the toilets looking for backdoor action. Breaking the law, if the staff ain't hiding by the bins eating snails then all they want to do is to bugger people. Born and Services is a ruthless place for young men and squirrels. Almost there, Burko Football Club will only take minutes now. My creator is sick of making this cartoon and he needs to search for his missing sanity. He mistakenly gave it to a dog. Well I had it for 10 minutes but traded it to get free drinks and a hefty kick in the plums whilst having a mush to internal conflict. You're a very bad dog, you should not pick on vegetables and in case you had not noticed, you're about to suffer a symptomless coma and miss the gig, I hope your genitals rot. News flash just in. There has been witness sightings of a red cloud hovering over Berkhamsted, covering a large area and drawing in psychotic crowds wielding pickaxes and jelly. Okay you cheap slapper, let's dump the baby and get to safety. I hear half the town has already been torn to bits by gangs of psychos and tights. Wasn't your baby anyway, Dick? I found this one in a stable surrounded by Christians so I did the right thing and murdered them all. The baby was a trophy. I lost hours in Aldi. Whoever appeals to the law against his fellow man is either a fool or a coward. Whoever cannot take care of himself without that law is both. For a wounded man shall say to his assailant, If I live, I will kill you. If I die, you are forgiven. Such is the rule.